What is going on, my fellow YouTubers? This is Ricky J, man. Welcome back to another Rumble. And this one's going to be a crazy one, man. We are going to be doing Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter all in one Rumble. And just so you guys know, I'm going to be using Liu Kang, one of my favorite fighters to use in Mortal Kombat back in the day. And I cannot wait to see what happens. And the winner of this Rumble is going to punch their ticket to the Champions Rumble, where we will compile all 30 winners from previous Rumbles into one big Mega Rumble, man. That's a lot of Rumbles in one sentence, but I cannot wait to see what happens. Everything is randomized. We don't know when we're coming in. And um, I'm hoping to come in late, even though some of you guys were saying I do better when I come in early. So... We'll see what happens, but I'm excited, man. I'm excited. You know, at the end of the day, <laughs> this is all a good fun, but um, I just hope I don't get picked first or second. So let's see who's going to be leading things off. And who is that? That looks like it's... That's Sub-Zero, baby. <laughs> Sub-Zero kicking off this Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter Rumble. And that's a really good <laughs> Sub-Zero. He's kind of looking around though. Kind of unsure why these people are making noise his way. He's looking at them like, why are you making noises? But he's coming in knowing that he has to do a job. And that is to survive against 29 other competitors. And look at him right here. He's embracing it. <laughs> he's finally clued in that they're cheering for him. And he's embracing it. But that is a spectacular Sub-Zero. And this stadium, I got to tell you, man, this stadium is a created one. And it looks like it has like 60,000 people packed in looking to see some history right here. There's a lot at stake, man. There's a lot at stake. I want to let you guys know that we are, we've just reached the second half of these rumbles. This would be, um, I believe it's the 16th or 17th rumble. So, um, we are really kind of moving along. <laughs> it doesn't seem like it's been that long. <laughs> but um, we're having so much fun making these theme rumbles now. And um, I cannot wait for the Ultimate Champions Rumble to see who is going to win. But let's see who's going to win this one. And let's see who Sub-Zero is going to be locking horns with to lead things off. This is always crazy, just waiting to see who he is going to be facing or who is going to be the second wrestler in these crazy matchups. So here we go. The delay. We're waiting. I'm anticipating that. Oh, no, it's not us. That's E Honda. <laughs> you thought it was going to be Yokozuna, but it's E Honda. And you know what's nuts? That's a great E Honda, but I was going to say. Five years ago, I found out that E stood for Edmund. And he is a fantastic athlete, man. He moves quick. He's got the quick hands. Remember in Street Fighter, he had those quick hands. And he was able to use his strength to really stifle his opponent. So let's see how he does against Sub-Zero. You know what's crazy? I keep on <laughs> looking at Sub-Zero and thinking of Scorpion. Oh, but... You know, man, I'm short of words. But their colors were different, but they looked a lot alike. So let's see what happens here. Let's see if Sub-Zero can withstand the strength of Honda. Here we go. And we've seen the green mist before with uh, Joe Rogan in previous matchups. And I think even with Shrek. So are we going to see Sub-Zero try to freeze his opponent? You just never know, man. We've seen some crazy things, but good start by Honda. Oh, going with the butt action. And Sub-Zero is already up against it. Oh, and now here he goes. He's got to utilize his kicks, his punches. Who's coming in here? Oh, it's Jax. Jax coming in. And you know Jax has that strength. But look at, look at Honda's agility. Jax has that strength, man. Looking like he's in the best shape of his life. Wow. Interesting move by Honda, deciding not to continue with beating up Sub-Zero. And oh, look at <laughs> Sub-Zero giving him the Undertaker taunt right there. <laughs> Slit the neck. And look, they're both going at him. 
Mortal Kombat is teaming up against Sub-Zero. Oh, I spoke too soon. Oh, here comes Balrog. Wow, look at that power by Jax. But you know when they made Balrog, you know they were thinking about Mike Tyson because he has that same build. He even looks like him. And here we go. Street Fighter versus Mortal Kombat. You got Honda and Jax. Balrog and Sub-Zero. Oh, now Honda <laughs> is going after Balrog. You got Sub-Zero. Sub-Zero, I just feel like he's having a hard time getting used to this style of matchup. Who's it going to be now? Oh, it's Blanca. <laughs> I can't wait to see this created Blanca. Here he comes. <laughs> That's great. Look at him. Oh, and it's strength for strength. That was always a great matchup. Honda and Blanca. Oh, nice uppercut by Balrog. And Jax is already stunned. Blanca. <laughs> I always mix from Blanca to Blanca. I'm going to go with Blanca. He always has that crazy agility. He has that crazy agility. And here comes Reptile. He has the agility mixed with strength, doesn't he? Let's see how Reptile does. Coming in. Going right after Sub-Zero. That could be a mistake. Oh, Jax. Uh-oh. Balrog looks like he's done. Just couldn't really get things going. Couldn't really utilize his great boxing. Who's coming in now, man? Who's coming in now? <laughs> Who is it? I'm waiting it to be us, man. We're Liu Kang. Oh, here comes Bison. And you know what was crazy? I was thinking about this. Oh, no. Blanca's done. It would be really cool if they... If you could add the sound effects for Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter. <laughs> I remember growing up, my brother used to always use Raiden. And I used to always laugh when he would do that flying spear. Because what kind of sound was Raiden making, man? Do you remember? He would always go like... -ba 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 <laughs> it was like really weird. but Anyway, let's get back to the action. Oh, Reptile! Going with that great elbow off the, off the middle rope there. Who's coming in now? Goro! Remember, Goro... Didn't he have, like, the four arms? I don't think we're going to see four arms here. That's a massive Goro. All muscled up. Looking to kick butt and take names. I'm telling you, Sub-Zero just needs to use his quickness, man. He just can't seem to get going this whole rumble. But surprisingly, he's still in it. You got Bison going after Honda. And Jax now. Getting, oh, manhandled by Goro. Oh, here comes Hawk. Thunder Hawk from Street Fighter. Remember him? And he's a big boy, too. Wow, look at the size of this guy. Thunder Hawk. Oh, nice move by Honda. He tried to pick him up, but he kind of, like, uh, tweaked his lower back there. Did you guys notice that? Uh-oh. Wow. Great strength by Thunder Hawk. You got Goro hanging on. Goro's done. What a move by Bison. Bison with a great move. And even Sub-Zero showing that heart. Who's coming in now, brother? Kano. Oh, no. Honda's done. <laughs> Honda's done. I don't know who eliminated him. I was looking to the left. Too many things are happening at once. And here comes Kano. Usually he has, like, that faceplate on the one side, but he's got it on both sides. He knows he's going to be absorbing a lot of shots. Is This could be the end. Oh, Sub-Zero. Great move by Sub-Zero. I would be really disappointed if he's out, man. I was a huge fan of Sub-Zero back in the day. Oh, but he's totally stunned, but he's hanging on. Just not used to this type of matchup. And look at Jax just posing to the fans. Here comes Cyrax. And this is um this is pretty interesting because this is look at Cyrax coming in. Wow, all armored up. Let's see what he can do. I love this matchup here. Bison and Hawk, Thunderhawk, kind of going at it. And I always say in these rumbles, it seems like the guys with height and weight seem to do well, man. I feel like it's a lot harder to eliminate guys, the big boys, man. So it's going to be interesting to see how this pans out here. Here comes 
Shang, Zong, Shang Song, and I apologize for me butchering some of the names, but this man is a legend. Shang Song coming in here, going after Bison. And oh, 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 Sub Zero is done. How heartbreaking is that? I'm telling you, Jax's right hand is lethal, and he's laying on, laying it on Kano. Jax has to watch out. But Hawk just walks right by him. Now he's going after Kano. Oh, he tried to go with, oh, sweet chin music. Is he gonna be out? Nice reversal by Kano. Bison having a little trouble against Shang Tsung. And look at this. Cyrax trying to go after Bison. Reptile is stunned. Cyrax given a ride by Jax. <laughs> You got Hawk who's stunned in the corner. All right, who's coming in? Starting to get even more nervous now. Fei Long, and remember when they made him, when they made Fei Long, they, you know they were thinking about Bruce Lee. Cause look at him, he's got the same kind of skills as Bruce Lee does. Uh oh, is Bison gonna be out? Good save by Bison, and good save by Hawk. Oh, I'm just, I'm adjusting my positioning here on my uh, gaming chair. I'm just crouched forward in anticipation of us getting called in. Uh oh, is Jax gonna be done? Wow, I don't know who saved Jax right there, but Hawk got clocked. And he just needs a moment to kinda gather himself here. Oh, Shang Tsung, oh, is he gonna get rid of, oh, poor Jax. He's done, he actually did fairly well. But uh, prematurely he was taken out. And who else was out? Wow, Thunderhawk, oh, <laughs> I love that. A dropping headbutt. Who else just got eliminated? Everything's happening so quickly. The camera angle zoomed in. Man, I would love to go back and check the tape. I think it could have been Reptile, I don't know. But Bison getting worked by Sung. Oh no, Cyrax is done. What a move by Fei Long. Going after Bison now. Uh-oh. Wow, look at the strength by Hawk. Picking him up and throwing him out. Here comes Aaron Black. Aaron Black coming in. Wow, that's not Woody, that's Aaron Black. Here he comes. Going after Bison, Kano. Doesn't have a dancing partner to deal with. Like what Kano's doing though. Waiting for his opportunity. Going after Long. You got Hawk who's stunned. Big shots by Kano. Long reverses him. And then with the kicks of his own. Oh, Black getting kneed into the face. People need to look at Hawk. Here comes Akuma. And here he comes, man. This guy's a legend here. Akuma coming in. And again, I tell you, let me know in the comments <laughs> if I'm butchering the names. I know it's Akuma, not Akuma, but I'm going with Akuma. And he's got the flip flops on. Wow, look at Bison. Don't tell me he's gonna get ragged all. What? The trash has been thrown out by Hawk. <laughs> this guy's a beast. And Akuma giving him the chops. Dalsum's coming in, and you know he's not gonna have the super long reach. Remember that in Street Fighter? He had that reach that could totally, no pun intended, but reach halfway across the platform. Remember? But he was slow though. But he had that long reach to make up for it. And Fei Long giving him the business, already stunned. And Akuma trying to take out the beast thunder. Oh, Thunderhawk with a great move. Big driving elbow. All right, people, who's coming in now? It's Mike. And this is Mike from the original Street Fighter. And I remember playing Street Fighter 1 back in the day when I was on a trip in Orlando, Florida. And I was so impressed with Mike. He was so big and he had great boxing skills. That was the tough thing about Mike. He was so hard to beat. You, got, you had to really kind of back away from him and use the fireball in Street Fighter 1. Remember that? Can't stay too close 
His boxing was second to none. But look at Kano. Oh! Dalsum's done. And Akuma giving Hawk the chops. And this is us. Here we go, baby. And again, I don't do well when it's crowded. This is kind of unfortunate. Here we go. Oh, we're oh. giving it to the big man. Oh, we're going after Thunderhawk. Tried to give him a, a Russian leg sweep. Oh, we got elbowed. Yeah, and I think Hawk is somebody we got to avoid. Somebody we got to avoid. Maybe go after Black. There he is. Oh, we're going after Akuma. Here it is. Oh, I got to be careful. Oh, no. I can't see. Oh, man. What moves. But Fei Long saves us. And here comes Ryu. Remember, that was one of the biggest arguments back at the arcade. How do you say his name? Is it Ryu, Ryu, or Ru? We're going to go with Ru. Oh. Look at this. We're helping out Hawk here. Oh, nice shot. He's black. Oh, no. Kind of over uh, did it there. Oh. Oh. We have to go with the finisher. Oh, man. Here it is. Oh, good recovery. See Fei Long. Man. Oh, no. Wow, we get saved. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Aaron Black. Oh, there goes Thunderhawk's done. Oh, my gosh, the big man's done. Okay, we got to be careful here. Got to know when to pick our spots. Again, I'm not the greatest at this game. I can't continue to be stuck in the line of fire. As I'm just standing still like a mannequin. Not moving. And look at that. That's a good matchup. The old school matchup. Mike and Rue. Going after each other. <laughs> look at Liu Kang, man. He's just chilling. Not trying to move a muscle. Not trying to move a muscle. Uh oh, Akuma, could he be done? He's not. We're still chilling, though. Still chilling. Hey, why move? Why move? Let's try to hop. Oh, oh. Oh, we got to go after him here. Here comes Johnny Cage. Oh, nice move. Oh, it looks like, it looks like Mike is hurt. Let's go. Oh, look at this matchup. Liu Kang and Ryu. Fei Long, is he done? He's done. Oh, nice counter. Uh-oh. Oh, big clothesline. Oh, counter. Oh, here it is. Switching positions of the finger, baby. Can't speak, brother. Oh. Oh, couldn't get it. But it really took a lot of wind out of his sails. Here's another one, and another one. Oh, I should have. Oh, there's Johnny Cage. Johnny Cage coming out. How could you do that? Oh, and we got clocked. Blindsided. This isn't cool. Oh, big shot. Come on, Johnny Cage. You got to do something. We have a history together. <laughs> We've got a history together. Yes, I like what he did there. He have totally avoided me. And here comes Yurian. And he's a big boy, man. This guy's a big boy. We're at 21. Is he going to come? Oh, nice move by Johnny Cage. Again. No. Uh oh, There's Aaron Black trying to ambush us. Oh. See if we could land something here. Here we go. This is our finisher. Oh, Yurian. How dare you? No. Oh, this guy. Oh, look at the alley shuffle by Mike. Mike was doing the alley shuffle. Here it is. But Mike fighting out of our finisher. Oh, Aaron Black is done. That was so cool. Mike was doing the alley shuffle. Man, it seems like we're getting reverse left, right, and center. This is just so hard. But Liu Kang's still managing. Let's, oh, Mike reversing us. Got to get out of this. 
Oh, I just ran into him. Oh. Oh, come on. We gotta land something. Here it is. Oh, again. We tried to land our finisher, but we were totally stunned. Now we're getting jabbed. Oh, I'm clotheslined. Mike is giving us the works here. Oh, no. Don't do it, Mike. Oh, and we're done. Ha <laughs> ha. That just is too much for me, man. Mike was just too big, too strong. And here comes Kung Lao. Wasn't he related to Liu Kang? Oh, man. This is totally heartbreaking. There was just too much traffic in the ring. There was never a moment where there was enough room for me to just move around. I was trying, but oh, look at Mike. Getting <laughs> Mike is tied up. Oh no, Johnny Cage is done. <laughs> Kung Lao. Mike is doing great though. Uh oh, but Akuma. Is he gonna take him out? Oh, what moves? Akuma with a fantastic technique right there. Taking the big man, Mike. Is Kano's done? Oh, look at this matchup. Wow, that's a great matchup. Ryu. And Akuma going at it. And here comes Raiden. And that's a, a pretty interesting Raiden. What was his name? What was the guy that played Raiden? Lambert? Let me know in the comments. But he's got the white hair flowing. Hair slicked back. Look at this matchup. Ryu and Akuma going at it. Same styles pretty much. What is he doing? Why does he give up on him? Oh, sweet shit music. Kong Lao's done. Uh-oh. Shao Kahn. This guy's a beast. Look how big he is. Yurian giving the thumbs down. Oh, what a good move. And is he going to eliminate him? Oh, that would have been crazy if he did. This is pretty interesting now. Look at Ryu doing his thing. Pump in his chest. Oh, nice move by Yurian. Uh-oh, Raiden. Don't do it. Give him the spear. Give him the spear. Like in the game. <laughs> and like I said, that sound effect was too funny. Ha ba 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 Here's Scorpion. Oh, nice. I like how Scorpion just kind of sneaks in. Oh, nice reversal by Ryu. It's, it's Ryu. Let me know in the comments. Do you call him Ryu, Ryu, or Ru? Let me know, man. I'm going with a mixture of Ru and Ru. <laughs> but look at this match. That's a great matchup. Scorpion. Oh, gets reversed. Zangief coming in. And like I've been always saying, the big boys always do so well. And him coming in this late is fantastic for him. Oh, Nice clothesline. They look like a Hulkster clothesline. <laughs> By Shao Kahn. <laughs> and Akuma doing some fantastic work here. Doing some great, great work. And who's coming in now? Three, two, one. Guile. Guile's coming in. Come on, baby. <laughs> Look at that guy. That's a great guy. I love it. I love this. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this. Zangief getting destroyed. Yurian with the power bomb. Oh my gosh. That was crazy. Shao Kahn. With just getting outclassed here. Big splash. Look at Raiden and Ryu. Going after each other. Zangief and Akuma going at it. Scorpion getting clotheslined by Guile. And how about that Guile? That hair is on point, man. That hair is so on point. And uh oh, Scorpion. Good job by Scorpion. Fighting back with those elbows. Speaking of elbows, Shao Kahn slowing down the offense of Guile. We're nearing. Pretty much the tail end of this. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, Guile. Wow. Survives. That was crazy just because Shao Kahn 
kind of misjudged that run. And Guile is still in it. Scorpion getting hit against Ryu. Akuma going after Raiden. Look at Sangeef with a big right hand. That was a nice right hand. And is Yurian going to be <laughs> taken out here? Look at that face of Zangief. Is he turning him over? Is he going to do it? No, good job fighting back. Scorpion using some nice acrobatic moves. Oh, what a move by Akuma. And Ryu is done. You don't have to worry about me butchering his name anymore. That's kind of sad, man. It's my favorite guy to use in Street Fighter. Oh my gosh. We still have like a bunch of guys left to come in, right? There's just so much going on. I feel like Akuma is amazing, man. He's doing some good things. He's eliminated a lot of guys. But he just may not have enough gas in the tank. Guile doing a dance. Look at him. Now that's bad business here. Oh, oh no! He was too busy showing off his after party dance moves. And Zangief says, give me your arm, brother. I'll show you a dance move over the ropes. Oh, that is too bad, man. That is too bad. Who's go Oh, Shao Kahn is done. Here comes Vega. Scorpion. Saluting the crowd. This is good for Vega, but they get, again, I kind of feel sorry for him. Undersized. Undersized, but is he going to be able to use that speed, that agility to just avoid, you know, I would just say avoid traffic, you know what I mean? But right now he's getting pieced up. Beautiful roundhouse kicks by Scorpion, followed by a right hand. You got Raiden and Yurian going at it. Look at <laughs> Zangief stepping on Akuma. It doesn't look like he has a lot left. Sag it. Uh oh, no! How is Akuma getting the strength? How is he developing the strength here to still stay in, but to take out Zangief? And even Vega. Vega can't even slow him down. Wow. And you got Raiden and Scorpion going at it. Yurian and Saget. Saget needs to start using his Muay Thai, man. Oh, he's shaking. Who's coming in now? Oh, it's Ken Masters. Look at this, Razor's Edge. How about Vega? How about Vega? But yeah, I gotta say, Saget needs to use, oh, nice move. He needs to use that Muay Thai. Start using his kicks. They got to get after Urien here. As Raiden is done. Scorpion is hurt. Akuma and Ken going at it. Uh-oh. Oh, nice move by Vega. Oh, misses the clothesline. Scorpion and Urien looking at each other. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Nice. Good move. And Urien, um, in the game, he comes in his little tights. And he's uh, in his suit, battling it out. And speaking of battling, is Scorpion going to get eliminated here? Akuma trying to take him out. He's flipped him over. Oh, he's done. Here we go. You got Vega, Akuma, Saget, and Yurian <laughs> left. Is this? It is. It's an all Street Fighter final. Unbelievable. This is nuts. I can't believe it. I cannot believe this. One, two, three, four, five. The final five. It's all Street Fighter, guys. Vegas. Vegas got to be careful. He just got slapped. Oh. And how's Akuma doing this? You got Ken. Trying to survive. Uh oh. Oh no, Vega's done. Oh, big shot by Saget. Trying to take out. Again, they got to work on Akuma and Yurian. These guys are just beasts. Just hanging on. 
These guys are hanging on, showing everything they got. Ken and Saget going after each other. Uh-oh, is Urien done? Here he goes. Oh, I can't do it. Mistimed. But he's still pounding on him. I like this matchup. There he goes. This is when Saget's at his best. When he's utilizing that Muay Thai, the knees, the kicks, the punches. And Ken just can't seem to get anything going. Is Ken going to be out of this? Is Ken going to be out of this? He's hanging on. Oh, he survives. Interesting. I thought for sure he would have been done there. It was almost a guarantee he was going to be done. Oh, it looked like Saget kind of tweaked that right knee there. Oh, nice move. Avoiding the action. And Akuma. Uh oh, oh, uh oh, oh. No, don't do it to Ken. Ken survives it. How good is Ken? But then the pause, the kicks. And is Yurian going to be done? Oh, this is padded move. Down he goes. Final three. How about this? Saget. Akuma. Oh, teaming up against Ken. With the suplex, now they're coming together. Here we go, baby. Oh, nice move. Ken needs to regroup, man. Ken definitely needs to regroup. Is he going to finally mount an offense? No. Seems like he's getting reversed. Left, right, and center. Saget. He is absolutely spent. Is he going to come up with something to survive this? <laughs> nice kicks by Ken. I like how Ken's going down low and then backing away using the, the distance. Using the distance. Nice move by Saget. And could Ak... Oh, nice. Akuma's doing a nice job. Oh, big kick. What a front kick. And then a left clothesline. Using his offhand there. It's Ken. Ken just seems just completely outclassed. Both of these guys... Seam out class. Look at the kicks, the punches, the knees to the body. Ken just getting absolutely beat up. And Akuma's doing this with flip flops on. <laughs> this is incredible. What a performance. It just seems like he's in the driver's seat. Even though if you look at his power and his like his like health, you know, like his body diagram, he is hurt. But he's still trucking along. Oh, what a move. It looks like Ken is done, man. Can Saget save him? But Akuma is just working on really just beating him down. And he's just taking all comers here. Uh-oh. Here it comes. Finally. There's the elbows, the kicks. Wow. This is this could be the turning point here. This, uh, oh, nice duck under. And again, more punches. This is... Where Saget's at his best. Could Akuma be done? Oh, wow. <laughs> what a great move by him. It's never say die. Ken, Akuma, going at it. Nice DDT. Saget. Trying to stop this monster. Here it is. Here it is. This is his move. And now look at the showdown. Ken. And Akuma, same weight class. Both guys pretty much have, you know, the same skill sets. Oh, there we way to go, Ken. <laughs> going with a great kick. Wow. And look, he's going for the finisher. He's going for the finisher. That was like a nice little rolling thunder that Ken gave. Nice job by Ken. Is he going to be able to do it here? This would be huge for him. Picks him up. Is he going to do it? Oh. Didn't quite have the strength to throw him over. But he needs to continue. Akuma coming back with no power. No health. Completely stunned. Here it is. Is it going to be over? Ken misses. Oh, man. Come on, Kenny. Again, he misses. It's like he dropped his contacts. He can't seem to line it up. He can't seem to line it up. And now he got kicked to the booty. And he's getting choked out. The hooks are in. Akuma zapping Ken. His power 
zapping his health completely and he's tapping but there's no pinfall no tapping in a rumble and now he's going off the top oh Ken it seems like he's totally passed out he had it Akuma looking to put on the finishing touches decides to go to side control into mount rights and left double rights Ken can't seem to find his bearings here Akuma again Going with the double leg takedown <laughs> and more punches. Could this be it? Ken, what is he going to give us here? Oh, man, poor Ken. Is it over? This is the patent move and it's over. <laughs> Akuma. Oh, let me know in the comments if you call him Akuma or Akuma. But how can you not kind of look over this man right here in the Champions Rumble? He looked fantastic, and he came in pretty early, didn't he? He came in pretty early, and although undersized, he showed that he's got the strength and the willpower to win one of these Rumbles, and better yet, win the Champions Rumble. And look at him, looking all jacked up and ready for more. What a crazy Rumble that was, man. But Street Fighter, you gotta say, Street Fighter won. Street Fighter won this Rumble. Wow, that was probably one of the most action-packed rumbles we've seen. I know we've seen a lot of action-packed rumbles, but I felt like I was on the edge of my seat from bell to bell. And there you have it. Look at that, a guy that's not a monster going on to the Champions Rumble, man. Keep it locked here for more crazy rumbles, man. And holy cow, can't wait to hear your thoughts on this one. And again, I apologize if I <laughs> butchered some of the names, but... um. That's how I called them, man. That's how I called them. But anyway, guys, love ya. Have a great day. This is Ricky J. Can't wait for the next one. Keep it locked here for more. Take care. All the best. I'm out.